you know, be a lawyer. You want to have strong opinions, be a lawyer. You right. Know? Don't right. be a traitor. You, you might be uh, familiar with him, but one of the other traders uh, profiled in the book, he was the first one, uh, Peter Brandt. Uh-huh. Um, what was, what was uh, like, because you know how you were dubbed the contrarian. He, his thing was like a weak, strong opinions, weakly held. Right. I, I thought that was such a, a good way to, uh, you know, approach markets or, you know, have strong opinions, strong convictions, but be malleable, be willing to, you know. Be wrong. No, be that's wrong. right. And, right. And I find when I make the most money, um, my best return periods are when my system is lined up for something. Um, and my opinion is that that's what's going to happen, you know, yeah. because then there it is, right? Now my system is telling me to do it. And I also agree with it. So now I can kind of go like now, okay, my system will tell me to short all these commodities. I haven't agreed with it. Right. So I've only lost a little bit of money because I haven't agreed with it. Right. So I've kept it small. Um, but yeah, Strong opinions weekly held. I think that makes sense. Meaning, yeah, have a strong opinion, go with it. But if it's wrong, just get the hell out. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, so I, I enjoyed that a lot. So uh, the it, we'll wrap it up here shortly. I just kind of got some uh, some miscellaneous type of questions. How was the whole interview process with Jack? Because uh, I know this kind of I don't know if this happened before COVID or right as COVID was happening. Do you guys do it over Zoom or you guys talk in person? 